very broad. In Sufi parlance, love for the master is essential. That is because the master is seen as a representative of the esoteric function of the prophet. Therefore, the Sufi's love for the master indirectly is a love for the prophet. And of course, the love for the prophet is an expression of the love for God. These uh, Muslim Sufis constitute a legacy of love for the prophet in the Islamic tradition of Sufism. Gulen's love for the prophet stems from this rich legacy, as well as from the Quran and from the sayings of the prophet. Indicating his annihilation in the prophet, Gulen asks for a new rising. This rising, this is very similar to the Sufi's legacy, <coughs> indicated in the saying of the prophet. Yes, the Sufi, as the prophet says, has to die before he dies so that he can spiritually be resurrected.